will come and see you in my channel once again guys your host mr names so today i'm back with a new amazing video guys so in this video i'm basically i'm going to show you how to edit images uh like the brandon uh basically he's my favorite uh photographer and uh how to create the moody images you could basically say so let's get started with this video guys so before starting this video let me just please tell you that i'm not a very great photographer but i love editing pics and this is just a sample uh which we are going to uh which we are going to use uh for this tutorial so to help you guys out and one of the most reason which why i am using the lightroom app itself because i love the app uh editing itself instead of the sitting on the pc and editing images it really frustrates me and uh, yeah so let us start with this whole video guys the most important thing which uh we really see in the picture so mostly the temperature in the brandon uh, gallery is always mostly towards the left and if you see there it will just give you a perfect feel of what basically the image will really look like so go to the other tools basically the exposure i will really suggest it to just do a little to uh, 0.2 if it is already at a morning time you could just uh, reduce the exposure but if it is an evening type images you could just go ahead and just do it to 0.021 so next come the contrast part uh, i really love the editing with the contrast saturation and highlights basically these are the uh, common things but then also you could just go ahead and play with that around if uh, you really want to edit the images so next comes with the clarity guys so mostly the people what they does is uh, they really end up uh, with this and really don't know what to do at this point so the clarity is what basically it could make your images dull like this itself it is looking like a grandma and it could also give your pick a really pretty feel so it depends upon your use so basically i will really suggest it to do on the minus side uh, to it will give a moody image so what you need to do now is just go ahead and just click on the color hue so this is what it really gives our images a good feel so just keep this at the top so to know what color it will really match your image so I would really suggest it to keep it a light blue and even if we put the filter it will just turn yeah so the red so the purple uh, color who I really love the most and it will really give your images a good feel if you really do it does it uh, does and make sure once you have done selected the color hue and just move around and as you could see the images now clearly looks gives a good feel so if you ask me the color hue what basically i really use is the purple uh red and then comes the blue and i will not really use the green but it is really uh useful while you are using the portrait images so that's it so the temperature of this thing so i will suggest it to keep it a light here to minus 80 and uh, you may be th wondering now what how to what uh, but the image is clearly not looking the similar what we really wanted so for that uh, uh, for that there is a solution just go ahead just tap on this and you will see an option called tone curve oops yeah so this is uh, the most important part guys so this is uh, it will uh, it will just change all the surrounding of your image so just i will just uh, uh, try uh, i will just suggest you to just go ahead and just uh, do it with the downwards so that's it once you have done with this now if you want uh, now let's give this a little uh, reddish feel so as i said i love uh, red images uh, mostly the red tones so here it is so that's it once you've done with this now you could just go ahead tap on the images which we were using and yeah so this is our final image guys and you may really see the difference between our previous one and the new image which we have just edited and that's it 
so that's it guys thanks for watching i hope this video is really helpful and if yes you could just go ahead and check my instagram for more and that's it guys thanks for watching and don't forget to uh hit that subscribe button and like for more and if you want more videos on the lightroom of the editing from the app itself you could just go ahead and uh, comment below so i will be making many more videos related to the lightroom that's it guys thanks for watching uh see you in the next video guys your host mr hamster signing out